How to fix the Gcash app EKYC enabled error. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are encountering the EKYC which is enabled error on Gcash app, this typically means there is an issue with your account verification or identity details. Other reasons for this could be mismatch in personal details, incomplete or pending verification, server or app issues during verification, or unstable internet connection. In order to fix it, here are some solutions. First and foremost, check your Gcash account verification status. For this, open the Gcash app and log in. Then after you have to go to your profile and then from the profile section, check your account verification level. It could either be basic which is for limited transaction and other is fully verified which is to access all the features. If your account is not fully verified, proceed with the verification process. This includes going to settings and tapping on verify now or upgrade account. Submit your valid ID such as passport, driver's license or UMID. Complete the selfie verification process. Ensure that the ID you provide matches with your registered name in the Gcash. Now that this is done, it should work. And then move on to next solution. Long press your Gcash app and go to app info. Head over to storage and cache and then clear the cache. Now reopen the app and try again. Another thing that you need to confirm is about the app version. Sometimes outdated app versions may cause the EKYC errors. For this, head over to Google Play Store or App Store, search for Gcash and update the app to the latest version. Always make sure you have a stable internet connection as unstable one can interfere with your account verification. Once all of this is checked, you can resubmit the verification process. For this, you can either head over to the help section or contact us section. After that is done, you can just email support at the gcash.com if the issue persists. If not, you can provide the details such as registered mobile number, screenshot of error message and description of the issue with the chat or email as well. So that's it for today's video. For more such contents, do not forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Thank you and keep watching.